Talking about this weekend, you guys got big weekend uh, traveling to North Carolina facing a and and Central. <laughs> yes, definitely for us that's a big weekend. Like you said, we definitely want to show that we're competing. I'm changing a little bit of the strategy of our rotation, trying to bring the best of us, what we can do really on the court, individually as a player, what they um, what they showing as a skill level that they feel comfortable enough to emphasize them, to emphasize the confidence in them. So it's gonna be a big question, but for me, I'm just waiting for a big fight. And then uh, just talk a little bit about, you know, last week, you guys had four matches and stuff like that. You know, you, you know Michaela kind of led you guys in the, in the kills, and but Caitlin had a good overall performance. You know, with a lot of kills, assists, and even blocks. You know, that's that's my first idea: is putting games together in a schedule to really show me, indicates me who is becoming the leader on the court, who is really trying to fight, and then having um, less practice. In some points, games are becoming the best practice ever because on the during 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 practice, during drills, you cannot really. Um, do the same scenario with coming up on it. I mean, you can fake it, but we're gonna know this is a controlling situation. On a game, there is additionally emotions adding to it, and that a big influence on uh, female players especially.